Hello, everyone. My name is Victor, and uh, I want to tell you about one of the worst and most longest days uh, of my life. So, I was living in Shanghai, China, for over a year with my girlfriend. We have a dog and a, our pet cat. We adopted them. We love them. And they're part of our family. So, we, we were there in Shanghai for a year, and it was finally time to come home because we had to go to school and get our family back home. You know, so we pack everything up, we're ready to leave, we make sure our airlines, are, you know, our tickets are perfect, we get our passports, our, our, uh, our tickets, our pets are vaccinated and everything, and they have their, all their paperwork done, and so we book our flight, and it's in the... 11 hour and 40 minute plane ride back to the to LA and so we kept making sure every couple weeks before we left that is it okay for our pets to go on you know because it has to be under 12 hours and we were stressing that we were stressed out because it has to be under 12 we make sure so many times and the day we the day of uh, leaving we go to the airport we're checking out or we're checking in and the lady at the front desk tells us, your pets can't get on the plane. The plane ride is actually 12 hours and 30 minutes and you can't go on. So <laughs> we, we're freaking out. We were my girlfriend, we turned to each other and we're like, oh shit, like, what are we going to do? Like, we can't leave our pets. They're, they're family. They're, they're, we can't leave them behind. So we were frantically looking at different terminals. We're like, we're, we're just... We're scared. We're, we don't know what to do. We're we're nervous. We're just we're freaking out. And every airline we go to keeps telling, telling us, no, no, you can't, you can't get on. Uh, the plane ride's too long. So this this lasts around four or five hours, just running around. And the Shanghai airport is is huge. And we're carrying. I'm carrying like three carts of luggage because my girlfriends are around talking to everyone, while I'm carrying our luggage, our cart with our two pets, and we have three. <laughs> three huge bags and they're just they're heavy I was tired and I was worrying I was I was worried she was worried I was tired and we're just desperate so uh, we finally get to Japan Airlines and we tell them our situation and we hear like honestly the best words we've heard all day and they said we can't get her you guys can get your pets on they the flight was to Japan and in Japan to LAX but they said it was 17 hours overall. We said, that's no problem. We'll pay the fees, we'll pay everything. And so the following day, because the, the plane didn't leave till the next day. So we had to stay in this really cramped hotel with our six bags and two pets. And it was, it was, a, hard, it was a hard night to sleep because we still weren't sure if our pets were going to get on. We were, we were just almost excited, but not really because we wanted our pets to come with us, and we did. We wanted to make sure they were on the plane with us, as we wanted to see them get on with us and come home with us. So the next day comes, we wake up super early, cause and we take our bags again. I'm carrying them all again, and we get to the airport and we check in, and they're fine. They take our bags, they take our pets, and as we're waiting in line to get on the plane, I keep looking outside the window, make sure that all the all the baggage is coming into the airplanes and I keep looking for the <laughs> my cage, the cage is the big brown cage and the little blue cage and I keep looking for them, all I see is luggages and luggages and it wasn't until we get on the actual airplane walking down the aisle, I'm still looking out the window, probably bugging people, bumping into people, just looking out the window and I'm still nervous because we want to see them on, it wasn't until we sat down and I'm still looking out the window. There was a passenger next to me and I'm just saying, sorry, excuse me, sorry, I'm trying to see my pets. And I glanced over to the other side and I, there, there I see the two cages and I see my little dog's nose poking out and I just, I'm, we're happy. And we, we see them, we follow them and they finally get on the, the plane with us on the bottom of the cargo and the plane takes off. And I, at that moment, I'm just, I'm happy. <laughs> my girlfriend's happy, we're just, our family is like, it's our pets, uh, our dog and our cat, we love them, and we're attached to them. We're never gonna leave them. That was never never an option, but we finally made it home to, uh, to LA.